Hi, this is Amy. Thought I'd share some fun with you. Um, we're in my garage, and this is a window in my garage, and behind the road closed sign is one of the panes of windows that has been broken out since we moved in. And we moved in in 1985. In my defense, this house was a piece of crap when we moved in. It was built in the 1870s and had some additions done in the 40s and then this garage and the basement in the 60s and we added on to it in the 90s but <clears throat> um, this was never a high priority um, to get fixed. So I decided uh, we better get it fixed. So um, all I got so far for tools is I'm going to wear a pair of gloves. Um, I do have my regular glasses on. I, uh, there's no broken glass here. The glass, I don't remember if we took the broken glass out or if it's just always been gone because it was here when we moved in. Um, you know, brick. And behind here, most of this garage is underground because this, they, behind us goes like straight up the hill. So I guess the first thing I'm going to have to do, oh, and here's my new piece of glass. I, it might be too big, otherwise I'm going to have to probably get a new piece cut. I don't think they can cut a quarter inch or something off of that. So I have two putties and I'm going to use the glazing. Um, I can't use points because this is metal. Uh, they did give me these clippy things that you're supposed to shove in some holes, but I'm going to gather that these holes are not here. So we're going to try and figure out how to get this to stay in there. Um, this putty knife I'm going to use, you know, when I'm finishing with the glaze. This one's just an old one that I'm going to use to chip out this old stuff. I just really want to try and see if that piece of glass is going to fit. I know it's got the paper on it. Cool. Fits with the paper on. We're good. Oh. Except now. <laughs> oh, now i got to go outside and push it out. And hope I don't push it too far. piece of glass cost me I think eight dollars and thirteen cents to have it cut. I just called ahead and ordered it and stopped and picked it up. <clears throat> also talked to them about how you know because I didn't have a wood frame with the points you know what to do with that. Oh, okay, well. So I'm just going to continue pushing the putty in there and then once I get it in there, you know, I'll take my knife and smooth it 
out. Okay, I've got it done. I pressed it in there as good as I could and got it smoothed out. It's not really smooth because it, I couldn't get the putty knife in there really good, but it, it will match the other ones. Um, I really didn't want it like perfect because the other eight, because there's four there and then there's another one there. Um, none of those look very good either. <laughs> so anyway, but I got it done and I do want to look out at those hostas and I think next year I will plant some flowers and uh, kind of spruce up that a little bit so went way better than I thought it would thanks for watching have a great day